Introducing the Shark Twins, Erlen and Jerome. Hi, babies. Erlen and Jerome were born on June 2nd, 2018 in Las Vegas, Nevada. They were also born in the same amniotic sac, making them rare male and female twins. After a few weeks, their breeder noticed that something just wasn't right with the way they walked. This was the breeder's first litter and had no real idea of the things that should be done prior to breeding Weimariners. Things like genetic testing. So the breeder reached out for help, which was absolutely the best decision. Tickle Pink Weimariner Rescue was able to bring the twins in and after a vet visit, they were diagnosed with spinal dysraphism, commonly known as Hopper's disease. Hopper's is a genetic disorder in which both parents must be carriers for the gene to be passed. A simple test can warn any potential breeder of the possible disease for any future litters bred. Right away, the twins exhibited many of the clinical symptoms associated with hoppers, including uh, the bunny hop gait and scoliosis in Jerome's case. When the twins were first born and up until they were a few months old, uh, they had trouble using their back legs. Uh, Jerome's worse than Erlen is because he has curvature of the spine, so it took him a little bit longer to get more confident and strong, uh, but once he did, once both of them did, it was like the sky's the limit, that nothing could stop them. They were happy, normal puppies that had absolutely no idea that they had anything wrong with them. Since we were based in Las Vegas already, we agreed to foster the twins. And after just a few weeks, we absolutely knew that we wanted to make them permanent family members. They were so special and so sweet. And uh, we knew that if they were with us, we would definitely give them the best chance to live a full life, even with the hoppers. It didn't matter, they're so wonderful. Another thing we noticed almost immediately was how truly bonded they are. That's why we made the decision to keep them together as well. The connection they have and the support they give each other, I've really never seen anything like it. Erilyn is a bit of the older sister, and she's also a little bit more mischievous than JJ. So she takes the lead in some ways, and he relies on her, but she also relies on him for a lot of other things too, uh, a lot for comfort. He's the one that uh, knocks his paw at the back door when they wanna go outside, and she follows him right out. They really are a team, and we are so glad that we decided to keep them as a pair. And I think everybody who meets the twins also sees that, uh, sees that bond, sees what we see, and it's an amazing thing. The Shark Twins nickname came pretty natural. The moment we got them to the house and, and put them on the ground, they just looked like little baby sharks swimming around each other, and the whole thing just kind of clicked in our head, and we said, hey, the Shark Twins and it stuck from there. We are so grateful to all of our friends and fans who have followed us on social media and have also reached out to us privately with truly inspiring stories about their Weimariners who also have spinal dysraphism. And it just goes to show you that with the right family and the right training, um, anything is possible and can and will be done.